Hi, and welcome to my channel. It's me, Tina. Today, I am here to show you what In Love Art Shop has sent me. Um, they asked me to try some of their products, so I agreed to do so. So, um, In Love Art Shop is a craft store um, online, and it's In Love Art Shop uh, <coughs> excuse me dot com <clears throat> that's how you get a hold of them and i will have their link below and i have a i will have a coupon code for you so that you can see what um they have to offer um i have done my unboxing for you i will put that link up down below also and um so we'll just jump right in um and I will show you. So the first one is a, um, <clears throat> I believe it's a memory decks card. Now, to be honest, I was not quite happy with this because um, this is supposed to have, um, so you, you cut these out all separately and then, um, you cut this part out and it's supposed to all keep them together so that it's like a window. Now it keeps cutting this, these little doors off and I will show you what they look like. So this is what it looks like. These little doors are separate and this is separate. And then the frame is also separate and it keeps cutting that off. So, um, I managed to get one that kind of stayed together, so um, it still it still uh, kind of cuts it apart. You can see right here, um, it kind of does. So you have to really reinforce it with glue. And um, I did get one to work, and it comes with these little uh, <clears throat> perfume bottles, and then it comes with the word "hello," "smile," "love," and "with love." I mean with so and the these three words they come together which I love and then the with the W is separated from those three letters so I just did that letter in a different color to show you and yeah this is um, so I did it in a vellum because I figured you know that's really strong it shouldn't break then but it did Um, it cut it cut them off right here as you can see it just sliced them um let me see and i did them with like glittered paper where's my glitter here's that one so again it sliced it off and i did it with thin paper book paper cardstock and there's some more and then i just kind of um you know, <clears throat> glued them together. Um, I put a piece of paper here and just glued it. And it does turn out cute once you have it together. I like the way it looks. But yeah, you see these cut apart. So I had to cut one like this by hand. And then it stays together because the, the die cut didn't cut it at all. And then I just glued one of the loose pieces on the front here and left a little border. So it is cute once you can get it to work. So that is that one. And then um, I just put here hello with love and I did the little perfume bottles. So it's cute once you can get it to work, but it takes some finagling to get it to work um now i have um <clears throat> this one this die cut and it is a large one it is beautiful it is absolutely gorgeous this is the way it cuts out it cuts out fantastic um i just love the way it looks and um, so here I just used part of the die cut 
<clears throat> maybe I should show you. Oh, okay, yeah. So here, here I just used part of the die cut of one piece like this. And I have too much stuff happening here. here. I'll show you. So this, this one was cut like this. So I just used that part like that. I laid it over and glued it on. So that looks really, really pretty. So you don't always <clears throat> have to use the whole die cut. You can use part of it. This is what one piece looks like. And then... Um, you can lay this piece in there and then you could lay that piece in there. Now I'm just using bright colors for you to see what the difference are. Like they, they're not really matching. And then I noticed that this one had these holes in it. <clears throat> really nice big uh, holes. So I decided to put a like a string through it. And look at the nice effect you get. This would be really pretty for Christmas. And I just tied a little bow here. And um, this middle part, I just die cut in green and glued that on. So yeah, I think that turned out really, really cute. And all I did was I just took this uh, cord and I weaved it through. And this is the back of it. So if you wanted nothing in the middle, maybe Merry Christmas or something, yeah, just use that. And then this is the outside, uh, which I already showed you. I used um, part of it on this card, and it is just really beautiful, very beautiful. And then um, I made a um, card. This is a large card. Um, I did the outside a different color and then I did the inside here and then uh, I used the holes to put some twine through and I fussy cut some birds and made them look like they're sitting on a wire and then what I did with the little holes there I filled them with uh, little drops these are Nouveau drops uh, crystal and they're the blue but I just love this. I thought it turned out so cute. I just love that. So, yeah, I love that die cut. Then um, I got a couple of smaller ones. Now, these are three sets, actually. So, this one is the Faith Over Fear. And it cuts out like this. That's what that looks like. Um, do I have another one? Let me see. Yes. So I cut that one out and that one. So there's two of them. Um, you can use them over cards. Now, I didn't use it on a card. I was thinking of uh, putting it on this card over here like this. I think that would be so pretty. And yeah. And then there are these little envelopes, and they are actually functional envelopes. I will show you those. There are two sizes. So these are the smaller ones, like this. This is the bigger one, and this is the larger one. And I should have gotten a white piece of paper. I will get one. So, these are the smaller ones here, like this, and I just kept these loose because I just want to, you know, use them as embellishments. So, this one um, I, I cut out and um, I put a little stamp in here, and whoop, I can't put it back in. I put a little stamp in there. I added a little gem and it says special and you can actually close it. So they're really, really cute. Now you can put it um, this way and then glue it onto a card or something like that. And this is another one. I glued a little bird on it 
and it says wonder and again I put a little stamp in here really really cute and I glued the um, envelope closed here but I left the opening here and then this one is the small one you can do the same thing add a word this one says hope and I glued a little metal bird this one is empty and then this one I just put two little hearts here and put a little word in there and yeah these are just ready to be popped onto any embellishment that you want to have on a page or a card and then um, this one is another set it is um, like this film strip the camera the little quote bubble and then this little I think it's like a film uh, reel um, but you could use it as a clock or anything you would like to use it um, so what I did with this little um, film uh, um, film strip I made my own little film strips like this I added little pictures behind and then I added just a couple of black pieces of paper to add like the track there and I just thought they turned out really really cute so there's one like that in the blue and then here's one in black and then I used the silver here and this one um, like it comes with the heart so this is the original but then I wanted to have like four pictures in there so I just took one of the squares and by the way I used the little squares to put into my little um, into my little envelopes here so what I used was this little template here and I just traced around it and then I cut that out and there I have four little squares but I think it's cute with the heart too that is cute too and then this one it it can be used as a clock you can put you know the numbers on here one two three four five six. well it's not quite a clock but I mean you could put a little uh, spinning thing on here anyway but it's just a little cute embellishment like for a film uh, a movie uh, layout or something like that and then here is a speech bubble with a little heart and here's another version of the um, of the uh, film reel and um, I just added the black hearts that were cut out of this one I popped them in here just to make it stand out and the blue hearts I pop them in here so not with no waste at all so there we go and then um, these are the little cameras you can use them in any uh, you know scrapbook or journal and they are just so so cute so even this would make a cute little layout and you could add your picture right here um i think it would be so cute just having a scrapbook layout like that or on your journal page you could add them to the side of your journals uh, let me grab a journal here and i'll show you um you could just pop it in like this as a belly band and you could <clears throat> put um you know a card in it here I think there's just so many ideas um, to use this these little things for and I think in love art shop for uh, giving me the chance to show you these I really really enjoyed making them and yeah go check out in love art shop and I will leave all the links down below so you can check check them out and get your uh 
get yourself a little shopping done. <laughs> so thank you very much. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have not subscribed, please consider doing so. Um, it just motivates me to do more videos, more, more crafty videos. And yeah, it just shows me that you're interested in my channel and what I have to show you and tell you and all that kind of stuff. So God bless and we'll talk to you soon. Bye.